Fine. That was a loaded year. That was one of the best years in recent history. That was insane. From the face off your teams, and we'll take you live over there. Start again. Ryan Bullock has it now. He's out on the uh, special teams. Dropped it back to uh, Robinson across now to Neely. Neely trying to thread the needle. Off the crossbar and a score! Rebound, Tyler Secura finds the puck right off the pipe in front of a wide open net. one nothing. Garmin lead, power play goal, 7-20. Doing another good job of getting pucks to the net, so Garmin's uh, really settled down here. Here's Bullock now winding up as Ferguson. Score! Beautiful goal as you heard it ring off the iron again. This time takes a Dartmouth bounce behind Kasdorf and Dartmouth is up two to nothing. 5.55 left in the first. I was looking at the goalie there and all of a sudden this huge seam just opened up in front of him and uh, great shot there. At Men's hockey at Dartmouth.edu. Shorthanded attempt here for the uh, engineers. Is absolutely gorgeous. Had Krema connected on that one because he had a wide open look at the net. Looked like it was just one too many passes there as the puck is uh, scrambled all in front and it goes in. And it's going to be a goal wow. here for the Big Green, uh, not the Big Green, excuse me, for RPI as uh, that was kind of weird there as it was uh, ramped straight up in the air and you had about three Dartmouth players trying to bat it out of the air and I think what might have happened is we can't see it from this angle. It might have just rolled down the back of James Kruger into the net with that. Uh, RPI cuts the lead to within one. Yeah, it's amazing how quick a game can turn as It'll be cleared down the length of the ice by Jack Berry, and Berry's got it. He's coming in alone for a shorthanded opportunity. He gets pulled down. Are we going to see maybe another penalty shot? As Jack Berry takes the uh, shot in from center ice, in on Kasdorf. Here he comes with a quick shot in and just goes wide of the net. So uh, unfortunately, Dartmouth unable to capitalize on that penalty shot two in a row, but still a three to one Dartmouth lead with 13.34 left to go in this third period. Yeah, big ch big change in time, went back to the locker room and we saw the Dartmouth from the first period. Even though they won't win the shot count as they uh, unofficially lost the shot.